It takes a year for the Earth to orbit the Sun, and as it does so, it spins on its own axis, one revolution being a day. However, the Earth is tilted by 23 and a half degrees in relation to its plane of orbit, and it's that tilt which gives rise to the seasons. In the Northern Hemisphere summer, we're tilted towards the Sun, and in winter, away from it. However, during an equinox, the Earth's north and south poles are not tilted towards or away from the Sun, and the duration of daylight is theoretically the same at all points on the Earth's surface. Hence the name equinox is derived from the Latin meaning equal night. The March equinox happens on the 19th, 20th or 21st of March every year. So the equinox is indeed a movable feast. This year it will happen on March the 20th and it will be the day when the day and the night are pretty much of equal length all over the world. Every year there's some debate about when spring actually starts. Is it on the 1st of March or is it on the equinox? In meteorology, for statistical reasons, we divide the months into three month chunks. So for us, spring starts on the 1st of March. If we started on the equinox because it changes date, it would be difficult to compare the seasons from year to year as we wouldn't quite be comparing like with like.